It's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday, man. It's Friday, Friday. Let's do something challenging, Ali. Let's do it. Offer me anything. You name it, we do it. Uh, then Mount Fuji. Let's do it. When? Are you in? In. Tomorrow. Tomorrow is Saturday. Tomorrow is Saturday. Okay. okay. Do Deal. It. Deal. Jeez, Let's guys. go. Mount Fuji, wait for us. Hey guys, we are at the tip of Japan and this is a volcanic mountain Fuji and we are at a 3,775 meter above the sea level and it was not the easy journey. We said on Friday we're going to do the challenge. Yeah. And we did it. Go through the video, watch it how we did it. We have completed our preparations and departed from Yokohama at 4 p.m. Here we go to Mount Fuji. Yeah. Weather is so nice. Hopefully it's going to be clean and clear. No wind on the top. No rain. No rainfalls. That's right. That, that's what we're looking for. We plan to climb by the Yoshida Trail starting from the 5th station. This time, visitors are allowed to access the 5th station by personal cars which is normally prohibited. However, you have to enter the Fuji Subaru line before 6 p.m., which is the only road that has access to the fifth station. We are above the clouds, right? You can't see anything. In yeah, above the clouds, clouds yeah. Like Right. This is the fifth station. Normally you come here by shuttle bus or where is the parking here? Man? Ta taxi and start climbing. It's sunset time now. So we're gonna witness sunset and sunrise tomorrow. Fuji's just over there. We're gonna climb that. Now we are recording Mount Fuji sunset. Basic things are, of course it's going to be cold, so you need the warm stuff. We start from the boots. You need to have a boots, but it's good if you have the ankle close part, a longer boots. But I took these ones because I had the long wear one and I wanted to have the short ones too. Then of course socks and plus you need to have a thick socks, wooden socks, wool socks maybe, made by babushkas in the bazaars. I, I got this in Georgia. Then um, pants, some change stuff that you need and um, of course you'll need, um, I hope this will do, is my, um, let's say the coat. If it rains, raincoat, then what do you call it? Leggings inside the inside pants and um, flashlight, the headlight, which you're going to put on your head because um, we're going to start um, our climb at 8 o'clock in the evening. And you'll we'll definitely need the gloves. I took my snowboarding gloves, which are quite funny. And what else? Of course, we need a towel and then the sweatshirt. It's going to be cold, guys. So I took my beanie here, and beanie is there, ready. And when we'll be descending, yeah, obviously it's going to be hot. So I took my hat. Ah, also the the neck covering part, scarf. If you have a scarf, that will do as well. And of course, you need a cigarette if you smoke. <laughs> guys, those are the necessary stuff that you're gonna bring in addition bring some ma face masks because you will be, while you are descending the trail is gonna be quite dusty so keep your face covered don't bring walking sticks it's too much like the trails are quite easy aren't they especially the Yoshida one maybe well, oxygen paints, tube is yeah yeah oxygen oxygen are... tube probably not necessary or small tents well if somebody has a hard hard times and breathing then you definitely need maybe that, that tank of the, the oxygen. Yeah, but the, the, those are all extra loads. You're gonna be carrying your backpack and stuff. 
and we are thinking of buying water and uh, drinks on the way, right? On the way, yeah. And yeah. every single station there will be some huts, there will be like uh, washrooms. So if you bring cash, you can buy drinks. Right. The fifth station has shops and the restaurants. In case you forget to bring some essential stuff, you can buy them here. Also, have some warm meal before the kickoff. We are going to do bullet climbing. In Japanese, Dangan Tozan. It's a way of climbing Mount Fuji during the night without proper sleep and rest, and descending next day morning. This type of climbing is strongly discouraged, since the bullet climbers tend to have more mountain sickness, low oxygen saturation, and serious fatigue. Okay, here we go. Climbing route. Yoshida Fuji. Six kilometers till the summit, Yoshida Trail. But this six kilometers is different than regular six kilometers, exactly. right? Exactly, you are yes. ascending six kilometers. Right now we are moving in, in the, the middle, middle of Tatos. People are eating inside and still the stuff here. Oh, oh, that's the oxygen. O2, 1300 yen. Chips, and there's a lamp. Look crazy. Drinks, look, the drinks are 400 yen. Fuck's sake, 400 yen. The trail gets rocky and steep. We took short breaks and kept moving until we reached the station 9, where we were planning to stay. Reaching the summit too early is not recommended, since you'll have to wait for the sunrise at much colder conditions. Aman-san, give up? Yes. Huh? Yes. Give up? Let's get back home, man. Sweet dreams. Eating ice cream. Having beer. <laughs> Aman, let's give up. <laughs> Oh, it's a very rocky place and quite steep, man. We have reached station number eight, and here is first eight corner. There is no way you can lose the trail because there will be rope like this or a chain. So. If you keep following them, you will never, never lose your way. So, I see the chain there. And also on this side. At 1.30 am, we arrived at station 9, which is 16 minutes away from the summit. So we decided to take a short nap, but the hut was fully booked. We had to try sleeping outside but it didn't work as the temperature was around 5 degrees Celsius. After a while, space became available in the hut. We were able to take a 30 minute nap for 3000 Japanese yen. When you get closer to the summit, it will get very crowded because everyone is trying to be at the top just before the sunrise. Consider this congestion and have extra time in pocket so you do not miss the best moment on the summit. Just reached the top. This is the summit. Sun is gonna rise in 10 to 15 minutes. Just from there. Is that Ali Sun? Oh! Our guy is here. Man, where have you been? Oh, it's dark. I can see your face. Can you turn this way? Oh. You made it. I made it, man. The summit is clear of the clouds. We sat down and enjoyed the breathtaking scene.
After the sunrise, we went around the crater rim. The trail is about 2.6 kilometers and the hiking takes 1 to 2 hours. You get to see the amazing views of the crater as well as the silhouette of the mountain. Mount Fuji last erupted about 300 years ago. It is estimated that the next eruption will cause around 25 billion USD damage and make 750,000 people evacuate. じゃあ、ぶんやりましょう。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん。ぶん
that something was bothering me. Allison has been experiencing a serious headache since we reached the summit. As soon as we made it back to the fifth station, he visited the first aid center. He was diagnosed with mountain sickness, having low oxygen saturation level. This was obviously due to the blood climbing. He was told to go to the city center as quickly as possible. That's all from Mount Fuji and we strongly recommend anyone in Japan to experience climbing it.